Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you my trade binder for Pokemon. I will be having this trade binder during the TCG Con, which is coming up soon, so I'll probably be attending that. And yep, my girlfriend will be with me, as will her nephew, so you can come up and say hi. Uh, this is the trade binder that I'll have with me. Not really picky. Um, really just trying to trade up if that makes any sense meaning i'm trying to trade two cards into one i will probably have cash and i will also be willing as there is a orchard glare to buy as well as um trade well that's even more of a glare hmm so let me see Maybe if I angle it this way. It's been a while since I had. Okay, I mean, that looks better. It's only one card. So this is the Pokemon collection. Most of these I pulled myself, which is pretty cool. So there should be pack fresh. Actually, no idea what happened here. I guess I had to trade some cards. Uh, there is the Lilies and the Minas and... Like basically all the trainer waifus you could guess or ask for, I have. And uh, Erica's Invitation, Acerola from Burning Shadows. This is the shiny rainbow cards. The rainbow cards <laughs> used to be the most valuable cards. Now people want the full arts. And it's, it's uh, definitely interesting because the rainbow cards are very rare. And back in my day, like when you would pull one of them, it would be a big deal, especially uh, a good one, like a legendary Pokemon or something like, um, yeah, like a Blastoise and Pitlop, uh, Gardevoir tag team. Those would be more valuable than than like a full art. But now it's all about the full art trainers, right? And so on. It's kind of interesting. Um, obviously, there's a Rayquaza right there. There's a bunch of Gyaradoses, the big Pikachu. The Chunga Chu, and uh, yeah, this is my favorite trainers here. The Skylars, the Lusamine, and Lily from uh, that set that took me forever. It took me a lot of money to pull that card. Uh, and then uh, Charizards, of course, uh, this is a game of Charizards. So you got the shiny Charizard V, you got the shiny G uh, Charizard GX. And two rainbows on top of it. Another rainbow, rainbow. No, I like rainbows. I pulled all these on stream, actually, on one of my streams. Oh, these are both secret. And everything is in pretty good condition because I pulled it. These secret rare Charizards. Actually, I had no idea they were so valuable. Uh, because when I pulled them, the set, like, none of it was... A lot of the... I, you know, this is newer... A lot of the cards I pulled, it wasn't really obvious to me that they would be valuable. Uh, I, I, I don't know how to explain it. It just never occurred to me until like, I started checking prices. Uh, more vintage stuff. More Charizards, more vintage -y. I do have graded cards. I probably am not going to take my graded cards because I'm lazy. I'm going to hopefully take this binder and then one magic binder and that's it. Uh, for a TCG con uh, definitely willing to trade um, some pretty higher end stuff dark Tyranitar no idea he was valuable this anti again when you buy a collection it's not always obvious you know like obviously these free dogs are shiny versions of them uh, the Venusaurs and so on I mean they all have somewhat value and then these are my alt arts uh, here's a here's a pretty cool page took me forever it took me five thousand dollars to pull this that's how many pulls it took me to get it but i'm happy you know i'm happy i got it right uh blazing and remax never could pull it really you know like these battle style things are just a mess uh, oh, yeah, you got the Latios down in the bottom, some Pikachus, Mega Rayquazas, of course, Ray Rays. More Charizards. Obviously, this is a trade binder, and 
people love Charizard. So what I'm looking for is probably high end stuff. Like ideally I would be able to trade five cards, maybe give you a little bit of bonus on top of that for a one card worth about the same amount of money. So yeah, I don't love, you know, like this type of stuff. I'm not a fan of the modern stuff. Um, I'm also not a fan of the vintage. I'm a fan of the mid mod. Like it's really weird. I like sh uh, shiny stars would be cool. Uh, that type of stuff would be nice. And then, uh, yep. Yeah. And then there's uh, Pokemon Go. So that's my binder.